what's up, what's up, it's your girl Rain, the host of the most is Doghouse Radio, we coming through every Thursday, 8 p.m., and it's going down, baby. Put me out like that, nigga. I got to breathe, nigga. He don't know what he talk about over here. What's up? Ah, we back. You all right? Yeah, high five. High five. We back. High five. What's up? What's we up? We're building. Doghouse. You know, just drop my specs. You know, I like them every Thursday. We in the <laughs> building with my lovely co host. Tell me you all. Come on, it's rain. The hostess with the most is. What's up? Yeah, but uh, she smelling like chicken today, she said. Yeah, you know? I just came back from cooking in my house, so now I smell like fried chicken. I thought you was in a Badoo factory cooking, working. <laughs> Are you a joke? Nah, that's that's no, where that's, that's where your shorties be at. You, 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 you the first. Oh God! Yeah, that's where your booze be at. You put the liver in the chicken. You know the liver in the chicken. Nah, that's where your booze be at. Chicken heads. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, anyway, all right. Let's have a moment of silence. This is a sad case. This is a sad dog house. Like we we we, we riled up right now. We, yeah, we, we are. We amped. We charged because bullshit is going on, right? Definitely, talk about it, talk definitely, about definitely going on. Talk about what's going on in the last couple of days in, in, in the news and why we here. I think we everybody knows right what's now. going on in the last couple of days. Racism rock. still you... exists. It's still alive and kicking, and it still shows that you know there's no value and, to, to the and, black man, and, to yeah. the Hispanic man, to, man. To, to all yeah. men of color. Any man other than oh, okay, oh yeah. Let me play a disclaimer before we start. Is that the other one? All right, the views expressed by me and Miss Rain are not of the matrixstudios.com or DWI. Um, or the staff. Or the staff, or the interns, <laughs> or the, or the tortures that was here last week. Or, uh, I don't know. I'm Let's just like, it. keep it real. Keep it real, right? Keep it real. If you're telling the truth, you shouldn't be this kind of That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Like, at the end of the day, we're not saying nothing. I mean, the DWI, he, respect. To, to the boss man, DWI. Don't name money to the cops and stuff like Respect that. Respect to the DSN, but I'm just saying, let's be real. They're gonna take your, 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 what's the thing they If get? you're not upset about it, you on the wrong team. What's the thing they get when you, when you, when you, when you like, know the cop and then you get away when you get driving drunk? Oh, the PBA I think, card. I think, I think, you know, I got one of them shit. He said, I got a PBA card. Oh, you can go watch Mount today then. I, I can <laughs> watch Mount. Let's turn up then on the cops. Fuck oh, the police. No, 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 no. See that? What I'm gonna say is, Majority, the way I feel, the majority of NYPD, you know, they're, um, a lot of them are racist. And not all of them are racist, but some of them, I think, after being on the job for a very, very long time, they they, they become tainted. Right. You know, um, but no, I have family. I have really, really We're close family bad. that are, um, of the blue badge. Are the blue badge. You know, I, I've used my PBA card a, a few times. All right, we're talking about the PBA card. Now, we're talking about the get the guy. The, the, the no indictments. On the Mike Brown case and the Eric Gardner case, two unfortunate tragedies, deaths that went, you know. And then it's also the young, the young man, that the young boy, because yeah. he was twelve, that yeah. just got killed. Yeah, but you said he, you said he deserved it. I did not say he deserved it. Right, he pulled the gun out. Oh my God! Why were you saying that? Right, like right. We're not holding our tongues. No, no. You said homie pulled the gun out. Hold up, hold up. And it was what after, I said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm. I'm going to tell you exactly what I'm saying. Oh, my God. And then, no. What? You acting crazy right what? now. What? I would what? never, what? ever, ever say that. What I said was that his situation was a lot different than Michael Brown's as well as um, Eric Gardner. Eric Gardner. Yeah. Because he had what looked like a gun yeah. in his hand. Although, oh, yeah. although when they when they called 911, the person that called 911 said he was young and it may be... Um, it may be a fake gun. Needless to say, what I said though is that a lot of people need to realize on, that it's on, unfortunate. Come on, you drink charge bomb. Come on, you are a female charge bomb. Come on. Well, yo, shut up. What I'm saying is that he had a gun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What I'm saying is that he had what looked like a real gun. So he deserved to get shot. I just said that he deserved to get when shot. When is it a good time to hire a real gun in the street? Oh my God. When, are you kidding when me? When times when people are getting killed? But selling Lucy, do you carry a fake gun in the street? Unfortunately, he was 12 years old. So, yeah. The maturity level for him was gone. 
But let's be real, yeah. there are 11 year olds, 12 year olds, That's 17 year olds that are real, are packing real heat. Yeah. And unfortunately, those are the ones who be quick to blow that ass away. Yo, Jay, you know what I think that guy mother might have said, the 12 year old mother? You think I, 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 Don't say not disrespectful about that mother. I said she might have said something to this nature that, that, that you know. Well, but, I think I, I, that, I'm just saying, man. Just, oh my goodness. Let me tell you something. No, because I'm a mom. I can't. No. I can't be down with that. Right, so if I am just, not down with that. Whoever you are, I'm sorry. Who the hell you? No, I ain't joking. I'm saying his mom might have said that. Just see, baby, you never heard about it. <laughs> anyway. Back to Eric Brown. Uh, Eric Brown. I put both in there together, right? That was like a <laughs> fusion right there. What you call a two a uh, double? Anyway, um, it's unfortunate. Yo, I think you know what I think we should do? I'm gonna start this. I want you to help me. I think we should ban. I should we should boycott the New Year's ball, New Year's Eve ball drop thing. What you think? I think that'd be crazy. Would nobody come? The clock ain't gonna be there. Try. That 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 would probably be. <laughs> you would need. Right. You would need a whole lot of people. Cause you know how many there's people that come from around the world to see. Listen, the if you can hear the glamour, if you hear it within the sound of my voice, we are boycotting the New Year's Eve ball drop. Alright? I think we should do that. I think I think that's you know something that could be done and I honestly think that that would be really, really be cool if a lot of people came out and actually did a, you know, a, a protest. Um, you know, a lot of people are talking about protests and the tree lighting. What you mean? People who can you protest a tree getting lit? We gonna protest the New Year's ball ball drop. Do you know how much media that tree lighting gets? You know how much media that New Year's ball drop is gonna get? Tell all everybody shows that. Imagine a New Year ball with people playing the guitar. They ain't no one there. They just looking stupid. We at home laughing. All the cops there for nothing. They getting paid overtime for nothing. We gonna let the city waste our money. It's really our money we're paying for them to be down there that day. Yeah, we're paying we're, we're paying them to kill us. Yeah, hey, there you go. Set. It's in my ring. Yeah, woo! Uh, Hello, my family member's gonna be calling me tonight. Uh, <laughs> They're gonna be like giving my PBA card back. And I'm like, no. Nope. If you're a cop, call up, man. We don't. We, we, we want to talk to y'all, man. 718 Yeah, call, call us up. Let you me know, know why you think it's a right to kill black people. It's not even that, too. It's like, even, even, I've come across minority um, officers, and they're very rude. What, what's that CPR stand for? Courtesy Professionalism? CPR? And respect. And respect. Like, what, the last time I got pulled over. They said for cops probably Let racist. me just say this. I pulled out wait my PBR. I said, five. Trump, wait up. I said, stand for cops probably racist. Oh. Give it to me. I thought. That's how. Now, you gotta remember, media is not gonna show the the peaceful protest. They're going to show the riots. Yesterday, they showed it. But it was all white right people protesting. I didn't see a lot of black people protesting. Like, who's, like, what are, were we home watching the protest while the white people are doing our jobs? Like, we should be all, I don't, I don't see a lot of us. And you don't think that that was media? The yeah, media showing white people? Uh, hi, hello. Well, I, was How scared, you doing? I was scared to have a camera from a black angry man anyway, so. No, but let's be real. Let's be real. Media controls everything. Media controls, just like this, I, I, I'm not, I don't want to get off of the, the subject, but I'm just trying to make a point here. Right. Everything was Ebola, 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 elections. Ended? No, no, no more Ebola. What happened to Ebola? Uh, Bill exactly. Bill Cosby, that's what happened. Bill Cosby, you want to let But it's like, it's, it's a constant distraction, you know? But at the end of the Bill day, Cosby. the issue is, right. the issue is yeah. at hand yeah, both. that, you know, a I lot more people need to be involved in change. I okay? Speaking of Ebola, did you cook that chicken therapy? <laughs> no. E. <laughs> coli. <laughs> That's salmonella, Bill. Oh, okay, I got this. My disease is wrong. The you know Bill Cosby, not digress. Bill Cosby, they, they still fucking with him. They just want that man to just tarnish, they just want to tarnish the man's legacy. You want to be drugging chicks up? But you got to learn how to, to, to filter your anger in a different way. That's, that's the bottom line. And at the end it's, of the day, what I would like to say to all colored people, if we devalue ourselves, why would somebody else, why would another race value us? Why would they rate, why would they value our lives when every day the color, people of color are killing each other? And that's the I'm not scared day. of cops. I'm scared of niggas. I'm sorry. Let's keep it a hundred. Back to Ferguson. Why do we get on the subject? Because you just go, uh, you go left. All right, before we go to the break, do you think they could, there was another way they could have got that man down without choking him to death? 
you think it was a, another way they could have handled the... He was already on the phone when he was choking, right? Yeah. No, I saw the tape, and but he was on the floor, and he was saying, I, ca I cannot breathe. breathe. A couple of and times. he was he was still in the chokehold. Yeah. I don't necessarily think he needed to be in the chokehold still if he's on the floor, right? Like, once he was on the floor, they should have took the chokehold. But you know what I don't... What I don't understand is when I watch the tape and they're telling him to put his hands behind his back, they never said that they were arresting him. So why would, why would I mean, they I think somebody said he was under arrest, I mean, no? They, did, did, they, did they say the Miranda? Because I don't remember them saying the Miranda. The footage, the footage, the footage, the footage back there? Maybe yeah, you could, let me see. Maybe you can pull up a new commentary on it. Why you pulls it up? Um, let's talk about more so the solution. You can have the solution. Happy birthday to Jay Z. He's 51 today. <laughs> He's 51, trust me. I know. Start over. Young Hogan, you heard? Ain't nothing wrong with 50, baby. You still got the biggest bitch in the game. You got the The billionaires. And you got the baddest bitch in the game saying that. We'll be back, dog. I'll play some Jay Z, man. We got to celebrate his birthday. Yo, man, it's good, man. <laughs> Don't choke me, man. I'm choking my. Uh, hey, boy. Be back, doghouse. Be back. Oh, my goodness. I gotta keep this boy over here. With... I gotta bring up. A... Yo, listen, man. Yo, shout out to Spike Lee, man, because he was marching. I heard J. Cole's marching, too. I could manage Spike Lee. He was a little wet marching down. He got his neck. He got his neck. The cops got his neck off the middle, man. He said, the Nick's. He probably, he probably left the Nick game and said, they losing my honey. I don't need to fuck with him. What's crazy? He probably protesting the Nick's losing. That ain't a lie to y'all. It's what's crazy. He protesting that garbage stuff. Of the movie, you know, do, do the right thing. Radio! 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 Reflects art. Every, I, Eric Garner is the 2014 Radio Raheem. I put the chill on you. Oh, that's me under there. Is it life in the I was at work working. We had the zoo factory. <laughs> solution. Solutions to the problems that we, we are well, facing. There's already been a little solution. We have, um, shout out to Star, but he said he's going to come through next week, so. Nice. Is he? Yeah, he's texting me, so. He, 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 he has the Stop the Police movement. Big on shot 97, tune into that. Cause he's really big into that, you know, anti-cop, you know, violence and that's what it is. But solutions. Solutions. Cameras on cops. Uh on I cops. mean I, I agree with it, but how about it's taking good. a cop gun away? No no, how about giving a cop not a simple gun, maybe an alternate, like maybe a taser or something like that, maybe something and you could die from a taser. Yeah, but not before. I wouldn't give a taser in a bullet. What is it? Give, a, give all cops pepper spray. Fuck, pepper give spray. them rubber bullets. What's this this is Rain Fuck You of the Week. Hold up. Let me, let me get this man's name. Every week Rain's gonna go fuck somebody. Because she's so classy. Okay, why don't you do that while you talk about the guy? Listen, boss. <laughs> By the madness. You are very stupid. And nobody likes you. Jew. <laughs> all right? They need to fire Jew. <laughs> No, no, I mean, because he's so stupid. He's so stupid. <laughs> Shut up. Radio! I'm like, this is do the right no, thing. No, if anybody, if Don't anybody you read his, um, his, his article made me angry. Because, you know, a lot of people, you know, I understand everybody is entitled to their opinion. But unless you are a person of color, you can never understand. You can never walk our shoes. You can own your, you have an objective view. You've never been in the hood. You didn't grow up in the hood. You don't know what it's about. You don't know what the challenges that, that people face every single day. Absolutely. And that's what makes me so upset when people have these, these voices that they feel like, like I can't say nothing about people who grew up necessarily with a silver spoon in their mouth. What's father used to date Oprah? What? What? Yeah. What happened? She gives, yo, she loves She's being head? Yeah. What? Oh, I don't even want to say it. How did you mean that? This man called his son's father. Oh my God, this, this I am not father, his his Oprah. Daddy Oprah is me, sloppy, toppy. Oh my God. Give me the father, this is not your exclusive. I'm not a father, this is not your exclusive. Yo, Hunter, you know what? Oprah is your mother. 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 Like she goes in, yo. Like yo. She loves to do it. That's her favorite show. Oprah loves to get fellatio. Exclusive doghouse. But we get the exclusives. Oprah, come over there. Come over to the doghouse. Oprah, I have nothing to do with I got something for you.